Hey everybody, don't adjust your cameras. I went for a spray tan. And every time I go for a spray tan, people come up to me and go, wow, you're really tan. Just prepping my body for the Bahamas. Also, <laughs> everyone's like, you're going to the Bahamas two days because I shared my meal plan. No, it's four. It's four days. But when I shared my meal plan, you see only two days, but I plan Sunday to usually Saturday. So obviously, Joe's figuring out Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Okay, so the reason I've been going to Whole Foods is A, because there's certain foods that I ordered on Thrive that they now have and I can get them quicker. Or it's foods that I can't find anywhere or it's cheaper. Hi, Shannon. Um, so I'll share with you one thing I absolutely non-negotiable, if you guys buy the Wegmans Organic Broccoli, feel free to ask questions. I'm gonna try and make this really quick because the other one was so long. I uploaded it to YouTube, so if you go to my YouTube channel, you can watch it there. Um, non-negotiable, where did I put it? All right, well, you're gonna have to hold off on my non-negotiable. Okay. This is the unsweetened vanilla almond milk that I got. I bought five of them because I try to do a, a Whole Foods haul, usually twice a month. Yes, that's what I was looking for. Just hold up. Um, the Wegmans Unsweetened Vanilla is great. It's I love so it. Good. But they love this one it's more. So like vanilla-y. Very vanilla-y. Okay, I should just have her talk because I don't like almond milk. <laughs> yeah, I'll smile. But it's also organic. Okay, it's super good. <laughs> it's, and this is the broccoli. That's the broccoli, guys. It's a it, it's, huge it's bag. So good. It's good. It's that, like, it tastes like broccoli. God. But like, it's like miniature. Okay, I, I want to make this kind of quick so I can upload it to Instagram. And Instagram, you have to have under nine minutes. So I'm trying to appease to my Facebook family and my Graham family. The broccoli is the bomb. It's $3.99, a huge bag, guys. Huge. I bought two of them. It is not like the broccoli at Wegmans. The broccoli at Wegmans, I'm sorry, Wegmans, but their organic broccoli is like the stems. This is all florets. So I love it. Okay. Um, these biscuits, because they don't have them at Wegmans, the Immaculate Baking Company, super good. Love, love, love. It's amazing. Hi, Andrea. Um, the egg whites, these are organic egg whites. I did buy non-organic egg whites, but don't worry, I do that sometimes. But these are um, $3.99 at Whole Foods. If you buy organic egg whites, uh-oh, low internet connection. There we go. Um, uh-oh. Okay, we're good. But if you buy the egg whites at Wegmans, they are $7.99. I don't buy those anymore. No way. Um, okay, next. I think my son's on. He loves this bratwurst. Loves it. He studies German. So he's all about the bratwurst. I keep coming in and out because he put this temporary internet thing back here, but I'm gonna go up front. Okay, last thing back here is this smoked salmon. Now, Wegmans used to carry smoked salmon, and again, when you're looking at salmon, you want it to be wild caught. And this smoked wild salmon, where does it say it? It's on here. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna look for it, but this, I, oh, maybe it's the big wild salmon, Sarah. Um, but he will eat this whole thing in like two days. And I love it. And he has it for breakfast. He'll have it for a snack. In fact, I should call him down here to see his reactions. You guys know. Hey, Rye! Rye! Does anybody see? See what I taught him? When I scream their name, they have to say coming instead of what? I just want to see your reaction when I share with you so people don't think I'm crazy about the salmon. Oh, it's really good. Yeah. No, it's super good. Like, you had it for breakfast. I had it for breakfast, yeah. It was super good. Well, I bought it for you. Thanks. You're welcome. Mm. Oh. That spray tan. I know. He hates the spray tan. Okay, let's get back to... I'm going to turn I'm gonna turn the camera around. That way... Oh, it's a little brighter. So, usually... Whoa. Usually, I get these at Wegmans. You know I love these, but they were on sale two for six at Whole Foods, so I grabbed them. Plus, you guys, if you were Amazon Prime members, you get 10% off everything on sale. So an additional 10% off. They scan it on your phone. You go to the cart. Try it now. Maybe not right now. I just burped from my kombucha, which is a question I get asked all the time. My favorite kombucha. I'm all over the place. Trilogy. 
Go to your Amazon account, go to the little shopping cart, hit it. You're gonna see a little tab that says Whole Foods coupon code or something. So anything on sale at Whole Foods, you get an additional 10% off. Okay, let's get back to it. So you know I love these CSA chips, they're grain free. They're made with cassava flour, amazing. I got, again, I got four bags because this will probably last probably about two weeks worth if I allocate it out properly. You think? I mean, it all depends how much. Abby loves them. So glad yeah. so good. I These are chips, apple cider vinegar chips. They're made with coconut oil. They're the purest chips I can find. So I bought these. I did buy these, and I think half the bag is gone because I ate them. They're the bomb. Um, these were on sale. They do have these at Wegmans, yeah, but I almost ate all of them. No, there's no um, why did all of them? I shared. Yeah, look, look. So these are the... Bacon habanero. Are these the like best guys? Either just look at this grocery haul as like a better bad. Okay, so these really do taste like Doritos. But it doesn't mean you can eat. Doesn't matter. What is it? Serving size is nine. Twelve chips. Okay, I'm like that's full. But again, a better bad for the kids. Um, my daughter. Yeah, these are on sale. Absolutely loves these. Abigail. These are like it's like a cheese puff, but. They're apple cider vinegar and Himalayan salt. But they are like organic, they're paleo. Like those are the ingredients, legit, no canola oil or anything bad in them. Look through that real quick. Love that they use stevia. So I buy these for her. And then I, since they were on sale, I bought one of these. These are no cheese cheesiness. I'm like, ugh, what does that mean? But legit ingredients. You know how they use that? Look at boom ba doom nutritional yeast. If you use nutritional yeast, which is amazing, guys, like if you sprinkle it on popcorn, it does take on a cheesy flavor. That's the one that I use for nutritional yeast, and it lasts forever. You don't need a lot of it at all. Okay. Back to the better bad, hot cocoa mix. It is organic. Mm -hmm. There's still a ton of sugar in it. It's 20, ooh, 22 grams of sugar. There is. Yeah, that's a lot of sugar, but here's the thing. Those are the ingredients and I can deal with those ingredients. I know I can make my own hot chocolate. They don't like it. <laughs> I've tried it so many different ways where I think I've added like 17 teaspoons of sugar. I'm like, just try it. It's more, it's a better bad. It's organic. It's got okay ingredients in it for the amount of times they have hot chocolate. We don't have it like three times a week. If they have it, once a week, that's a lot for them. Like, especially in the winter, maybe it's on a Saturday. Like oh, we have a commentary. Maybe like, it all depends. Really, like, it's, sometimes it's like twice a week. Sometimes it's like, like we skip like a week or so, and then we have it again. I cut her off. Because <laughs> I got me, avocado oil. I love Primal Kitchen. Those are the ones that use the salad dressing cheaper. Uh, tonight we're having bean quesos. So we're trying to have a meatless Monday and I'm trying to go more plant-based. Maybe one more day if I can get it in. Those are gone. And those are gone. Um, <laughs> these are the refried black beans. What I like about them is there's no added oil. These are only like $1.49. I mean, that is really cheap. Uh, organic black beans, water, sea salt. Oh, geez. Sorry, guys. Boom. Easy. Um, let's turn it on. Okay. So I got two of those. My kids love blue corn chips. What kid doesn't? Again, a better bad with coconut oil. I got some bananas because I forgot them yesterday. I don't necessarily always buy organic banana. Oh yeah, I do. Hey. I do. Okay, here's the thing. Rinse the bananas. Cause the spider bugs. No, the fruit flies. This Pickles! is a huge deal. So why do I buy organic pickles? Because oh, they're good. Cucumbers. Cucumbers are in the dirty zone. Dirty dozen, so you want your pickles to be organic too. Wegmans are ridiculously priced, like like three times the cost of what these are. I have no idea why. And some quick oats. So a super easy haul that I did. I showed you all the dairy. We showed you the broccoli, and I think that was oh oh. Anyway, let me show you. These are the wild blueberries. Remember I chatted about those on the other video. I bought two packs of these. Wild. Wild is the key word, but like I said, I bought two of those. We go through a lot of blueberries, and then I just buy these at Wegmans. Also, I have not been able to find organic 
peas. Peas are something you want organic too. I don't know why Wegmans just hasn't had them probably like the last month. And I'm on a mission, so maybe you guys can help me out. I think that was it, because, oh, my eggs. My God, I gotta tell you the story about my eggs. These are free range, pasture raised, organic eggs, no antibiotics, no added hormones, no synthetic pesticides, non-GMO feed, certified humane, blah, 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 blah. Eggs are freaking ridiculous as far as what eggs you get. There's cage free, there's pasture free, there's organic, there's this. Don't get eggs that just say organic, guys. Make sure it says either cage free, free range, or pasture raised. I had the guy at Whole Foods, I was like, do you know eggs? Can you find this out? Because this one says this. Does free range and cage free mean pasture raised? Because if they're free range, they're out there, right? <laughs> we were dying laughing. I mean, I just didn't like the employees there. Um, so that was my Whole Foods haul. Hopefully this was quick and I can load it to IG. Otherwise, I will upload it to my YouTube channel and you guys can catch it all over there. Um, but I think that was everything. We're good to go. I feel like I had something else to say. If you guys have any questions, let me know. I am doing, my whole team's doing a three-day refresh the Monday after Thanksgiving. Perfect timing. Uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, just like a three-day Get back to you, start December feeling good so you can still enjoy yourself, have those cookies and cocktails for December because it's not about deprivation, it's about figuring out what works for you. So if you're interested in that three-day refresh, let me know and I hope you guys have a great day.